What's going on, Z Nation, and welcome to another edition of ZSPN. I'm your host, Zaid, here. And today, guys, we're going to be talking about Kyle Kuzma and the Los Angeles Lakers. As it concerns, a couple of days ago, uh, Kyle Kuzma was basically talking to some reporters as of late about the, the state of the Los Angeles Lakers and what to expect from the Los Angeles Lakers. And, you know, he brought his opinions here and there about what the expectations is, and obviously playoff is his is his main priority and obviously he put out there that he believes he is the third star for the Los Angeles Lakers. Uh, obviously uh, the number one star on the team is uh, is LeBron James and second it is Anthony Davis and Kyle Guzma believed that he is on the rank of being that third option for the Los Angeles Lakers. Now, before anything, like always, please be sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel, share my videos all over Facebook, Twitter, all the good social media stuff. And guys, make sure to follow me on Twitter at ZSPN underscore sports. It's the official Twitter page for this channel on YouTube. And also like my page on Facebook. Uh, ZSPN is also, it's, it is the official page for this channel as well so make sure to show me some love uh, like my page on Facebook ZSPN and follow me on Twitter at ZSPN underscore sports now my own thoughts and opinions about that uh, about that claim that Kyle Kuzma believes that he is the third option I said it since the beginning that Kyle Kuzma has to be the third star for the Los Angeles Lakers teams now, there has been some talks here and there that somebody like a Boogie Cousins is the third star for the Los Angeles Lakers team. Because obviously, Boogie Cousins, you know, he has been working out, he has been losing weight, and obviously he's coming back from after, uh, you know, a, a horrible injury that he suffered two years ago with his, with his Achilles injury. And we all know the aspects of an Achilles injury. Uh, obviously, it takes a while for a player to come back from that particular injury. And we're not even sure if the player is going to be himself again or if he's going to be a solid player. And honestly, I truly believe that Boogie Cousins is going to come back. He's going to be his old, same old self. I mean, obviously, two years have passed since his uh, Achilles injury. And um, obviously... He is going to be a much different player, and obviously he has a goal in mind to not just compete with the Lakers uh, for a title or a playoffs, but at the same time, he's, he's, uh, his main goal is to get a huge contract next season, and he wants to be in the conversation of getting a contract like around $100 million, uh, uh, type of contract for four years or maybe more, it still remains, but, uh, um, but some people thought about that when it came to uh, Boogie Cousins being that third star uh, on this Lakers team. But you really had to really think about Kyle Kuzma and the circumstance that he's in and how he's been developing this offseason and at the same time, what's his mindset when it comes to uh, this upcoming season. The guy is motivated. He's on the USA team, and obviously he is going to flourish with that uh, with that team. Uh, and obviously he is his goal in mind is hopefully for all of us that they win the gold medal. And uh, he has been working out with Carmelo Anthony, a guy who has been well known for his shooting ability. He's basically one of the top ten, top twenty, uh, top scores. In, in NBA history, I mean, just think about it, guys. I mean, look at his stats. I mean, the guy has always been a scorer throughout his career. And obviously, Kyle Kuzma even said that he's trying to improve his shooting. And uh, obviously, what better way for him to learn than from Carmelo Anthony? And I just hope that Carmelo Anthony is on an NBA team as soon as possible. I mean, I believe he deserves to be on an NBA team. And if the Lakers... Still remains to be seen about that uh, final roster spot with the whole, um, uh, with the whole uh, Andre Vidala situation and the Grizzlies. I mean, still remains to be seen that the Lakers are interested in bringing in Kamel Anthony, but still remains. And also, 
they're still the Denver Nuggets. I mean, they are looking for small forwards, and what better way for them to uh, get somebody who has well known for his years there, and plus a team that drafted him than is Carmelo Anthony. So um, I just my own personal opinion, and, and somehow if he wants to make a farewell tour, I think it's with the Denver Nuggets. But that's my own thoughts and opinions about that. But other than that, you know, uh, Kyle Kuzma is on the rise. I made a video maybe a couple couple weeks ago about Kyle Kuzma being having an all-star uh, season next season. I mean, I mean this upcoming season and uh, I truly believe he does. I mean, with the type of work that he's putting out there and you guys, if you see his physical appearance, I mean, the guy it is he is getting big. I mean, the guy is getting stronger and with his workout regimens and how he's been developing and plus there's a plus perk that he is on the USA team is learning from coaches like uh, Greg Popovich who's coaching that team and plus you know he has players around him that will uh, uh, elevate him to the extent of obviously being the best that he could be and there's a lot of players throughout this league that's uh, making making a huge support for Kyle Kuzma. I mean, the guy has been, uh, you know, getting well praises for his uh, for his ability to play the game. And from players like uh, Clay Thompson, uh, Donovan Mitchell, Carmelo Anthony, I mean, you name them all. I mean, uh, Kyle Kuzma is on the rise. And I truly believe, you know, this upcoming season, it's going to be his year. He's going to have a breakout year. And... If somehow if he's a ability to play the best uh, of his ability and having a great uh, uh, season, I truly believe he could be an all-star this year. That's my own thoughts and opinions about that. And honestly, guys, most Laker fans would agree with me that Kyle Kuzma is the third star for this Lakers team. I can't really think of anybody else other than Boogie Cousins. But that's if Boogie Cousins is ready to go and he is healthy 100 percent and he is that uh boogie cousin that we saw from him during his days uh, with sacramento kings at, at his final year and a little bit from the new orleans days i mean you know if we have that sort of boogie cousins yeah then we can make the argument that he is the third star for the team but still remains to be seen about that but you know the future is with Kyle Kuzma, if he wants to be, uh, if the Lakers want him as a long-term uh, player on their team, you know, after the fact with the, with LeBron James, then somehow, you know, Kyle Kuzma is just there in the wings to really take over this franchise. I mean, that's my own thoughts and opinions about that, and I hope that really happens for him. But, uh, you know, it is what it is. So, guys, please uh, comment down below. Give me your thoughts about the whole Kyle Kuzma situation and him putting out there that he is that he believes he's the third star for this Lakers team and uh, do you guys believe that he is or do you think it's Boogie Cousins I mean there's a lot of arguments I mean a lot of arguments between the whole circumstance that the Lakers are in when it comes to that third star that will match well with uh, with LeBron James and Anthony Davis so and plus you really have to think about it also I mean you know once LeBron, you know, whatever his contract ends and if he still has enough in him to, you know, still play the game, you know, uh, Anthony Davis is this, uh, you know, the Lakers are going to give the keys to Anthony Davis and he needs to have that other star with him. And that star, it is Kyle Kuzma because we're not even sure about the future of uh, Boogie Cousins when it comes to uh, you know his future contract that he's hoping to get next season. I mean, it still remains to be seen. And uh, honestly, uh, Kyle Kuzma, he's young, he is ready to go, and obviously he has a bright future ahead of him. And plus, you know, um, when it's when this whole um, you know USA team uh, starts, he is going to perform, and he's going to uh, give us a a great performance on the USA team and you know learning from coaches like Greg Popovich and um, 
also our coaches for the Lakers. I mean, obviously, he is going to learn a lot and obviously develop to a great player uh, in this league. And I just really can't wait to see out of him what he will bring this upcoming season. And uh, obviously, with the whole uh, first game uh, for the Lakers, uh, you know, competing against the, the L.A. Clippers, it is going to be very interesting to watch how Kyle Kuzma will deal with that sort of situation and will he elevate his game and obviously I just really can't wait for this season to start already to see this Lakers team uh, be a playoff team and also competing for a title uh, for in 2020 so uh, just really can't wait for that so guys please uh, comment down below like subscribe to the channel and you guys agree that Kyle Kuzma is the third star for the team, or do you think it's someone else, maybe Boogie Cousins? Uh, please comment down below, and make sure to follow me on Twitter at ZSPN underscore sports, and also like my page on Facebook. It's, uh, it's ZSPN. It's the official page uh, for this channel. I really appreciate your thoughts and opinions when it comes to um, the Lakers and your thoughts about, uh, you know, you're, you're just passionate about the, the Los Angeles Lakers, and I really appreciate that. And uh, please, guys, make sure to show me some love. Like my page on Facebook. Follow me on Twitter at ZSPN underscore sports. And I'll see you all in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Go Lakers. Take it easy.